After kicking off the season with a huge 49-point win over Rhode Island, the Jayhawks fell short against the Ohio Bobcats, 37-21. to You know, offensively, we got to do a better job uh, early in the game to be able to help our defense out. You know, they played, I know, over 40 plays in the first half, and I think we played like 15. After a slow start, which left the Jayhawks down 21 points at the half, quarterback Montel Cozart and wide receiver Steven Sims Jr. made two huge connections, bringing their team back in the game. Unfortunately, it just wasn't enough, and the team agrees they need to come out stronger initially to avoid playing catch-up in the second half. It's a short-term memory, so whatever happens to play, the play before, you brush it off in this new play. Uh, yes, the, the first half kind of got us in the hole, but I think when we came out the second half, we was ready to go, and uh, we really, was, really wasn't down, focused on what happened the first half. It was a new play, new, new drive. Uh, we just got to start fast. I think if we start fast, we can, we'll compete with anybody. We just can't get down like that like we did today. That's our biggest thing. Next up for the Jayhawks will be a trip to Memphis to take on the Tigers this Saturday at 11 a.m. Reporting for KUJH News, I'm Jen Halverson.